Hey guys, Mr. Random Trash. I know I haven't make a, made a video in like quite a long time. Um, I've been out of the game for a while. I'm just now thinking about coming back. A friend of mine told me it was like really skillful format, so it might be something I want to look into and see how it works for me. Um, but yeah, I figured I'd start it off with a deck profile of a deck that I was running towards the end of, or like towards the beginning of the format before I kind of like got out of the game. Um, it's pretty standard. It's kind of like just standard plants. Um, I haven't really looked at anything that has like topped or anything like that, so don't like be all like, oh, wow, that's fucking bad or anything like that, because I haven't really like looked at anything or anything like that. So, um, well, this is mainly my deck. Uh, he told me that everybody plays standard three tour guide. I only have two, so if uh, if that's something you guys are going to go off about, then yeah, I only have two of them. I guess I can try to get a third one, but whatever. Um, the reason I've been out of the game for a while is mainly just because uh, I've been playing like fighting games a lot more, uh, mainly like Marvel vs. Capcom 3. Um, me and a buddy of mine are actually thinking about devoting a channel to it and starting a commentating thing, so if you guys are into, into any of the Marvel scene or like Street Fighter or anything like that, just hit us up on that channel. Um, probably going to start within the next month when Ultimate uh, NBC3 comes out. Uh, we're going to be posting like different combo videos, different new techs, um, in between matches and stuff, like commentating on matches, uh, going over like matches that we played that we recorded, and seeing what we did wrong and everything like that. So if you guys are interested in that, just make sure you check that out and subscribe and everything like that. But uh, as for now, I'm going to go ahead and get the deck profile started for you. Um, play two tour guides. Standard from what I've been hearing. Sorry about the glare, guys. It's my lights are right above this. So, but yeah, two tour guides, um, three tango. So is that? Um, when I built this, I was scared about Dark World, and uh, other than that, that's the only reason why I have these two cards. I'm going to show you um, in the deck at this time, and it's based around like other cards that I was I'm playing in the deck too. So. Right now I'm maining two Doom Calibers. I think this card's really good against them, just because you open up with it, and then all their plays are basically like dead, because it negates anything that they do with any of their monsters. Since all their monsters have to be activated from the grave, it'll just sit there. So I think this card's good. Um, it's not bad or anything for like all the hand hand traps or anything like that, like Effect Veil or Maxi or anything like that. Because if they decide to do something like that to this, then it already does its job. It got it got a one for one, and it got something out of their hand that you don't want there for a late game. So I think this card's really good. And with Gates on the field, it becomes a twenty one hundred attack, no twenty two hundred attacker, which is really good. You can push over really anything. So very good card. Um, I think he's underrated if people aren't playing him now. So, but uh, play one effect Valor. I don't really like this against like any other matchup. I think it's really good against just anything but plants. So when I built this, I figured that plants were going to be good. And I only played one. I never really wanted more than one. Um, I can always search it if I have tour guide and everything like that. So uh, I played two maxis. I think this card's broken. It's like an instant like st end your turn card. Very good card, very searchable, um, easy to use with a lot of different things. A lot of people don't actually know how to play this right, which is very surprising to me, especially since it's very, very good, and people should know how to play it right, but whatever. Uh, Black Luster, obvious, most broken card in the game. have to play it. Um, I play 2KS. The reason I play 2KS is because I was fearing Dark World, like I said. Um, Basically, it was mainly just for that and uh, the other cards that I'm playing in the deck, too. So, um, I play True Trigodias. I think this card was really good last format, and I think it's even better this format now we have two. It's very devastating, especially if you open up with like a tour guide and a Sangan. All you have to do is just summon this, like, not even summon anything, just sit or like set the Sangan or do whatever you want to do. Um, if you don't set anything and they do attack you and they go like tour guide Sangan. You can do this, you can special summon him in defense, and then on your turn, pitch your dead tour guide to uh, grab their uh, Sangan, attack over their tour guide, and then go into a level, or a rank 3 guy. So it's very good. It's like a third, like uh, playing two more mind controls for certain situations, and it's a very devastatingly hard beater to get over sometimes, and you have to wait, waste a couple cards to get over him. So.
Gore's obvious. Um, play one Reaper. I think it's pretty underrated. Uh, it gets a lot of different um, different pokes in at a lot of different times. So very good against like agents and stuff if you can hold off their Hyperions. So obviously play Sang in for tour guide. Debris, even though he's not as good as he used to be, still broken. So one Spore, one Lone Fire, one Dandelion, and one Glow Up Bulb. And it's a German Glow Up Bulb that my friend gave me. And it is the hottest card I think I've seen in a long time. So, but yeah, that's uh, that's my monsters right there. Um, spells, two MSTs. I don't like three main board. Um, one for one. Scapegoats, book, enemy controller, pot of avarice, German, mind control, monster reborn, heavy storm, dark hole, and foolish burial. So pretty standard on spells. Um, the traps is where I kind of mix it up a little bit. I know a lot of people don't play this main board, and I don't know why, but I think it wrecks every deck in the format, especially if you can get it off with all the, the guys that I run. So not this card, but I play two solemn mornings. One Solemn Judgment, one Torrential, one Trap Dust Shoot, and then I play Deck Debbie main board. The reason I play this is because I play all the 2400 attackers and such. So um, I play a double Trigodia, so if I even open up with Trigodia, I can drop Trigodia. Uh, like if I go just set this first turn, even if they MST that, that's still a good card because they waste it on a card that does really nothing in that situation. Um, if they do attack me and I drop Trag, if I attack with Trag and they do anything, I just deck Debbie them. It's really broken. I really think this card's really, really good right now. And then I should see a lot more play, hopefully. Um, Synchros, I think, is standard. Like Leviathan, Levier, Utopia. I play this guy. I don't like Roach. I think this guy's better in situations. Um, I don't have a Hyper Librarian, so that'd be Hyper Librarian. Trishula, German Trishula, which is fucking sweet. Um, Scrap Dragon, Orient Dragon, Black Rose, Ally, Army Arm Formula, Ancient Fairy, Bionic, and Stardust. And then my side's just bleh. It's not even really a side. It's kind of put together random stuff. Like three Gemini and stop Dark World, Dark World, TG's, Dark World, Dark World, and Animeta, Dark World, Dark World, Agents, Dark World, and Dark World. <laughs> Kind of just how that kind of went down, but um, but yeah, um, this is Mr. M Trash, and like I said, guys, if you guys are interested in like the fighting game scene or anything like that, check out uh, the new channel. I'm gonna be starting soon, so all right, and uh, rate, comment, subscribe, do whatever you guys need to do, and uh, this is Mr. M Trash, and Deck Debbie's broken.